Hello friends, it's Elisa, not Alyssa, and I'm in Rome. As you can see from the title, I'm very excited. I'm doing lots of fun things here, which you're gonna see. Before we do that, let's jump back to this morning. This is day one of Rome. Che fatica questa storia Mi ha lasciato nel tornado Ora mi porgi la tua mano ma che noia Sei scappato, son caduta Ma ora guarda che cammino anche da sola E sono stanca di incontrarti ad occhi chiusi Poi mi sveglio il cuore brucia Ed io ho bisogno di tempo Ho bisogno di spazio Ho bisogno di te I made it. I'm in Rome. I'm in my hotel room. It's actually bed and breakfast, but anyway, you get the point. I made it. I'm alive. <sighs> what a journey. So I'm about to meet someone who you probably know and you'll see very soon. So since I just got off the train and I'm very gross, I'm going to see if I can make myself, you know, slightly more presentable. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Okay. Where is the towel? Let's do a little bit of um, spray some toner, refresh my face. Wait, is there another light? Oh, beautiful. I just want to make myself slightly presentable. Just, you know, hide the fact that I woke up at 5 a.m., which I was actually supposed to wake up at 5.30, but I woke up by accident at 5 o'clock. It's fine. I had more time to get ready. Okay, I think I look a bit more awake. We're going for, nobody cares, but we're going for a very quick, no makeup, makeup look. David is gonna see this and he's gonna be like, this is what you were doing while I was downstairs waiting for you? Yes. And then we do a little bit of mascara. Okay, how does this look? Do I look more awake? Not that your answer really matters because your answer is like in the future, but I'm gonna ask you anyway, okay? Why not, who cares? I think I look more awake and that was my goal. So I may or may not be with someone you know, and someone special, guess who it is? You have three seconds. Three, two, one. Ta da! You're, you're not talking about me, are you? <laughs> yes, I am talking about you. It's the famous, the one, the only oh, Davide on. from the you're, one, the only. Don't flatter me that much. <laughs> Podcast Italiano. And Hi, we. Guys. Hi, <laughs> we are Hello. together in Rome. It is thanks to him that I'm in Rome because he was, I don't know if you guys watched my live stream, my last live stream, but if you were there, he popped in and he's like, hey, I have uh, something to tell you. Basically, several of us are going to be meeting here in Rome and we're gonna be making lots of videos for you. Kind of an impromptu sort of lingo tubers, as I call it, lingo tubers gathering. <laughs> it's going to be a bunch of people who make videos about languages and stuff we all like. So Yes, we are nerds, great. nerd meeting. I'm excited. So I don't know about you guys. I don't know about you. I'm excited. I'm pretty excited. So anyway, now we're but just... I'm, but I'm more excited about breakfast. <laughs> we're right just going to go eat. What time is it? Like 12? 12? Yeah. yeah, breakfast at 12. So yeah, we're just going to go eat something. Now, because I have stupid dietary restrictions, because my body's very stupid, we have to limit ourselves to finding gluten-free things. But it's fine. We will adapt. We will adjust. We can do it. And that is all. Okay, we're back. So I didn't even show you what I ate, but I had just had a fruit salad because it was the only thing that wouldn't cause me severe problems. What did you have? I had a cappuccino and I had, what's it called? Pastry of some sort. Yeah, that's sort. not a bomba. That, no, a bomba cornetto, sorry, sorry. Cor that was a cornetto. The Romans like are a, going to be awesome. super mad at me. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot the name of their main breakfast dish. Oh my goodness. It was yeah. very good though. Uh, very sugary. I don't usually <laughs> have uh, sugary uh, or sweet breakfast. What do you mm. call it? The sweet breakfast. Sweet breakfast. Yeah. But when in Rome. When in Rome. Oh, this is nice. Look at this area. How cute. Anyway, so now we're just going to meet someone else. His name is Raph. I don't know him. I've never met him. But he's a linguist, correct? Yeah. Very cool guy. Very learned guy. <laughs> he helps me with my videos. Um, 
probably one of the most cultured person when it comes to linguistics and uh, you know, knowledge about languages in general. He's not a fake like me. Yeah, or me. <laughs> <laughs> We're meeting a lot of cool people, very talented people. So. Yes, I'm excited. Thank you, Elise. Aww, how sweet. So we're gonna go eat, right? We're gonna go have lunch? Yes. Where are we going? I have no idea. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out, yeah. We shall figure it out. My arm hurts. I'm too short. Okay. Turrigiano. Tur That's what? very important. Wait, Rafael what? Rafael Turrigiano. <laughs> is, that your, is that your last name or something? Turrigiano. 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 Okay, we're back. We're with Raf. Say hi. Hello. Yes. Hi. So Raf is, um, as we said before, not a fake like us. He actually knows things. Um, <laughs> a true linguist. Do I know things? Yeah. You do I not. Think you do. Don't, you aren't you a us. linguist? Uh, you gave us a lesson on Arabic dialects. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Go, you know so. things. Yeah, we're like already best buddies. Absolutely. <laughs> we started nerding. You know when talking to someone and the conversation just like flows and you're like, you're a nerd like me. Like That I, was the point of having <laughs> all these nerds hang out together. Mm. Yeah. That's what I hoped would happen. Tell us about yourself, my friend, if you Tell want to. Tell us about myself. Oh, God. Uh, he teaches Latin, by the way. I do. <laughs> If anyone's interested. I do. I'm teaching Latin to beginners at the moment. Um, I just graduated studying linguistics in the UK. I'm super into like ancient languages and historical phonology and historical linguistics and stuff like that. Yet another huge nerd, I guess. <laughs> We're just, uh, you know, going for a walk, enjoying the scorching heat, even though the sun's not even out. Maybe we'll go eat somewhere soon. Just yeah. want to say rafaelturijano.wordpress.com. No, <laughs> Trichano. I love like making fun of the way that I I mean okay I don't think I ever pronounced to that degree but I like over exaggerating our our accent and just because I love here's the thing I love Italian and I respect it so much and I do my best to pronounce it as well as I can and because I do that I give myself the permission to also ruin it so, is that okay am I banned no, it's totally okay. Okay, good. I do it. <laughs> I do it Italian. Carlo Italian. And it's not, it's not like, okay, now people are gonna watch this and be like, you're making fun of people who like are learning and don't, no, First I'm not. First reaction, shock. shock. First reaction, shock. I'm not, it's just also a thing. because. <laughs> yes, because. Shock because. The rap knows it by heart, so you can ask him. He knows the whole thing. <laughs> The thing about like accents is it's the reality of language learning and yeah, it's like, part of what makes language learning fun and you know different people have varying degrees of wanting to either learn the, the phonology of the language they're studying or not care about it. And like not everyone cares and that's okay. Like there are lots of people who don't have perfect pronunciation and don't care to have it. Like there's nothing wrong with that. But I think it's very healthy to like make fun of yourself. Sicuramente. Sicuramente. <laughs> Like, as you can probably tell, I'm getting to the point where I'm so Here's the thing, I woke up at five, and I don't usually wake up at five, and I couldn't fall asleep right away, and I was packing last night, and blah, blah, blah. I'm getting sleepy, and my eyes are starting to not work. So that's, that's where we're at today. What did we do? We ate. We're just like slowly meeting people, trying to figure out what to do in the meantime. We're going to meet Luke. <laughs> Native I, yeah, Latin speaker. <laughs> Native Latin speaker. Very fancy. That is not true. So, Elise is gonna learn Latin. Oh yes, just like in a day. Yeah. yeah, that's something you can totally do in like two hours. It's no big deal. Like there aren't people who study it for years and years and years <laughs> or anything. Oh, I can do that too. You're not special. A genius. Wait, what? Like Lisa is like a name, and your E Lisa, like the like. But it's not person. E. Yeah, it's E, like E apostrophe Lisa. Do you want to die today? <laughs> is that your pl like? Do you have a death wish? Is that your? Yeah, exactly. Alice. <laughs> no. It's but so yeah, sad. Elisa is sad. I have... By the way, do you want to say hi to my vlog? Introduce yourself. Hello. We have a new friend. I'm Yulia, or Yula, as we have just established. Yes. And uh, nobody can pronounce. Right, well, and I'm very happy Unless to be you here. Are Who are you? Unless you are Russian. Unless you are Russian, that is exactly right. Who am I? What do you do? What, what's your, who am I? Oh. I'm, no, I'm by, by no means, I'm not a communist. Okay. 
Soviet spy. Okay, I, uh, this is my friend Davide. Um, he's weird, yes, but that's alright. We accept our friends as they are, we don't try to change them. So. <laughs> <Davide Safari. laughs> Oh my god. I'm sorry, this vlog is such a cluster. It's okay. This vlog. That's why they love us. So, so uh, what so am I uh, doing with my life? That's a great question, actually. Right? <laughs> what what are any of us doing with our yeah, lives, well, really? Yeah, right yeah, now, I volunteer here in Rome in an organization called Wheel DM. It has yeah. to do with um, musculoskeletal. Oh, okay. okay. Like disability no, in general. Uh, and apart from that, I've been a language enthusiast. I am. I also teach Italian. I mostly teach Italian to Russians. Although recently I've been trying to help some American friends with uh, their Italian journey. Yeah, it's the same as me. I usually teach Italian to, to native English speakers. So. Yeah, I mean, it is easier to yeah. teach a language that you learn yeah, to the people who speak the same language. Yeah. Too. The guitar. <gasps> same. Me too! <gasps> you sing? Okay, guys, karaoke. No, 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 wow. no, no. She sings. Did you know she sings? Yeah, yeah you heard me sing yesterday. And she plays guitar. Did you tell me that? I don't know. Karaoke. All right, we, we, we have to. We guitar and. Do if we have one. Yes, we do. I live in Rome. I have a guitar. I play it and I sing along. Okay, this is happening. You're a musician. Sorry. Oh, last question. How many languages do you speak? Russian is my mother tongue. Good Italian. English. And I speak a little bit of French and a little bit of German. Oh wow. Fancy pants. I'm lame. I speak English and Italian and like not even French. Like hardly. I mean, German is virtually non-existent. Yeah, but you speak three languages like really well. Okay. I should like... Get my shit together on French. Anyway. Yeah, come on, Alice. <laughs> Rude. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> Look who it is. Dun dun dun. <laughs> you guys remember Elisa. <laughs> It's been ages since I've been in front of a camera. Has it? Oh my god, when was the last time you made a vlog? It feels so weird. It was months. I think it was almost a year. Oh my gosh. Can't believe we missed you. It's amazing that you're here. Yay! I'm so happy. Epoche hey, Sonia. There are other people who were late. We are very disappointed. Can they hear you? I'm not sure they can hear you. Recap. We ate again. Like literally all I do is say we ate. <laughs> we socialize and we eat. We talked. We ate. How and was it? we heard a scary man say <laughs> like literally we're walking down the fucking darkest alley of all time we can't see anything and i'm just like oh, it's kind of i'm kind of scared this is kind of sketchy right yeah literally like, what 30 seconds later we walk by like where it crosses with another dark alleyway and this italian man is like Eccola. which means there she is which if you speak italian you know that you know, that could also refer to objects, not just people. But I, you know, I thought that was going to be my death. Luckily, I'm still alive for now. You never know, maybe he'll follow me. He was probably talking about his car. He was I talking guess. about the motorcycle. Oh, the motorcycle. <laughs> he was talking about the motorcycle. Or anyway. you. Or you. Know. Well, or, or you. Or me. <laughs> for that matter. No, you don't know. So basically, we're just going to walk her to her bus stop. And then, to Davide's dismay, we're going to go home to bed. Yeah. He's very disappointed. I'm very disappointed. <laughs> what can I do? Well, what did you want to do at freaking like midnight after that day we had? Yeah, I actually I... asked Davide, Davide, what it is you want to do, and I never get any <laughs> response. Yeah. So what do you want to do? I want more socializing. We so, so you're that an after this week, and we socialize. So that all after we after this week, <laughs> I don't you don't need have any more to. socializing yeah. for a year. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's good. I, I mean, go back to my normal life. It makes sense. It's like a pretty decent plan, sort of. <laughs> <laughs> I'm personally on the brink of fainting, but because I love you, I'm withstanding. Yeah, it's very, it's very nice. Okay, I'm finally back in my hotel. I have to be quiet because 
It's a better breakfast and it's definitely not soundproof. Now I am absolutely exhausted. It's 12.30 in the morning. And considering the fact that I like fell asleep at 1.30, woke up a million times and then woke up at five and we've been walking all day long, I'm just destroyed and exhausted. So I'm gonna wash my face, brush my teeth and just jump into bed. I cannot wait to sleep. <laughs> so good night and that is the end of day one. Thanks for watching. See you on day two. Che fatica questa storia Mi hai lasciato nel tornado Ora mi porgi la tua mano ma che 